Botswana is home to one third of Africa's entire elephant population. They're a huge asset to the country's tourist industry, and the deaths of some 330 of the gentle giants earlier this year was described as a conservation disaster. After months of research, scientists now say they have discovered the reason behind the tragedy. A diagnosis of neurotoxic cyanobacterial poisoning from seasonal water plants has been made relating to the elephant mortality in Botswana that started April of this year. Curiously, the elephants, along with a single horse, were the only species that were killed by the toxic blue-green algae in the water. Scavengers such as vultures and hyenas that feasted on the carcasses did not become ill. Scientists have speculated the reason the elephants were so adversely affected was because of the amount of time they spend drinking and wallowing in the water. They've also said the deaths are not linked to man-made causes such as poaching, anthrax or sabotage. Now the diagnosis has been made, the focus can turn towards preventing further deaths in the future. Having isolated this going forward, we clearly know that the mortality, because it had stopped at the time when the pens were drying off, we are going forward going to monitor the situation and then come up with interventions to prevent further uh, mortalities in the next season. Botswana's elephant population is a conservation success story. In 1996, there were only 80,000, and since then numbers have swelled to 130,000, an increase attributed to military deployment against poachers and the isolation of its wildlife reserves.